Now, if you have been under a lockdown, you probably haven't got a haircut in a long time or you've been experimental and given yourself a haircut or maybe you've asked your wife for one. Well, that's all about to change because governments are finally realizing that hair salons may just be an essential service. Take a look at our next story. For millions around the world, a trip to the barber shop or manicurist is as routine as a run to the grocery store. But the threat of the deadly virus has disrupted the services. Hairstylists, manicurists and masseuses are among the many personal care entrepreneurs struggling financially, tapping into their savings, even though lockdown restrictions have been eased and salon owners around the world are gripped with anxiety. There is not much that came regarding financial aid. Regarding the reopening, we had to equip ourselves with a lot of things that we did not necessarily need before, like hand sanitizers, masks, visors, which was difficult to find. We had to share the message to all of our clients. We had a lot of mixed feelings between the excitement to reopen and also a sort of anxiety. Others say customers can't go back to their favorite salons as they'd have to ensure social distancing and proper sanitation. Feels good to be back out doing, doing what we love and glad to see everybody out and practicing safe guidelines. You need to sanitize wash your hands and for each customer you give a break in between each customer clean your station and you want to cut when you cut and you want to cut with a mask on and make sure your client has a mask on as well in the context of a pandemic close proximity required for hairdressing is a problem the salon experience won't be the same anymore the rules have changed no waiting area, no magazines, no dry cuts. Both customer and hairdresser are required to wear face masks. Hairdressers will have to ensure five feet distance between customers. Hairdressers will continue wearing gloves till customers' hair are washed. And talking face-to-face -face is not permitted. Any communication about cut or color must be done through the mirror and kept to a minimum. On the other hand, reopening services after severe lockdown restrictions salon owners in Switzerland suffered huge economic setbacks. I have suffered an enormous operational loss. I'd say I have already lost close to 40,000 euros over the two months. I have had to take a bank loan in order to pay the rent and repay everything I need to. My revenue has been halved. Even with masks and other safeguards, one question still remains. How safe will it be to be touched by a manicurist, masseuse or makeup artist?